what makes a good interview and what makes a bad interview. Action! Hi, I'm Coleman Andy, I'm at college. Hi, I'm Kathleen, nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you too. Please have a seat. Thank you. Well, first, thank you very much for coming in today. Very excited to meet you. Thank you for having me. So, could you just tell me a little bit about how you became interested in New York College? Um, this is a little bit embarrassing, but since eighth grade, I've been reading the Fisk Guide to Colleges for fun every night. Um, wow. Yeah, I know, a little obsessive, I'm aware. Um, and so I read about it then, and I've been doing a lot of online research since then. I've gone on several tours. I did an overnight, um, and during my overnight, I just got this sense, corny though it might sound, um, that this was really a place that I would love to spend the next four years, and that I'd be challenged on a daily basis. Um, and that it really met all of my requirements for college. So it started out with me just reading about it and then I've done more thorough exploration okay. of the school. Okay, that's great. Could you tell me just something specifically about New York College that really turned you on? It sounds like you did a lot of research, yes. that you came, you've come to the school and you've done a lot of good homework about why you want to be here. Um, well, I really like the fact that there's no core curriculum mm -hmm. um, because I want to double major in subjects that are kind of different and sure. want to have a lot of overlapping um, classes and so mm -hmm. that would be possible here. Okay. Um, and I have heard a lot about how um, enthusiastic students are about their yes. classes and that they're here because they care about school and not just to get good grades to get into grad school though a lot of people do go on to grad school and that people are like quirky and nerdy and the student body is absolutely phenomenal and right. I feel like I could fit in well here. That's wonderful. Okay so if I were to talk to your friends could you just tell me maybe three adjectives that they would use to describe you and why? Um, passionate, overly enthusiastic, okay. um, and intellectually curious. Oh wow, okay. Yeah. okay. So in terms of, um, that's a really interesting list, uh, with intellectual, intellectually curious um, as an adjective, could you just tell me maybe how that came out in high school, a subject yeah. you found very challenging and that you enjoyed? Mm -hmm. So I took AP US History my junior year, oh, wow. and it was by far my favorite class that I've taken, and we had to do this history project, um, and uh, the Noah Webster house is near my house, um, and so I did a lot of research using primary documents, and I learned about this guy, Frank H. Statmuller, um, who kind of innovated um, like the mill pasteurization process, oh, wow. which at first I thought sounded kind of dull, but I learned a lot about him. Um, and I went through all these old newspaper articles um, that were amazingly online and went through a lot of documents there. And so I really delved into this and I thought that was an amazing experience. <laughs> um, and my APO's history teacher is the town historian, so she oh, helped wow. me out a lot. And we, okay. she was really, really um, helpful That's to great. me. So. Yeah, that's really cool. And I discovered that I have this love for history and um, doing archival work. Uh -huh. so. Wonderful. We have, as you know, a very strong history program, so I'm really excited to hear that you've done a lot of research about why you'd like to come here, and it sounds like we're very aligned with some of the great departments that we have here. But what are some other things you might want to try while you're at your college? Yeah. Um, so I played volleyball for four years throughout high school, and okay. I've been talking with a coach. And oh, great. So yeah, and she came and saw me play, and I did an overnight with the team. Oh, so wonderful. I think I'd like to continue with that. Mm -hmm. um, I have several friends who play rugby, and so okay. I think I would like to try that out. Um, I'm trying to think what else. I am also not a super outdoorsy person, though I would like to be, and I heard that your outing club is awesome. Yeah, so. we have a very good outing club. In fact, I could put you in touch with maybe one of the student leaders of the outing club to help you learn more about the college. That would be wonderful. Thank wonderful. You. Okay. Well, it seems like we're coming to the end of our time. Um, do you have any questions for me? Yeah. Um, in your time here, um, mm -hmm. what are some of the major shifts that you have seen happen? Like, has there been, I know that your school has had this reputation of being rather liberal and like a hub for activism. I'm wondering if that's changed over time or if that reputation has like, has maintained itself sure, sure. throughout the years. Sure, that's a really great question. We definitely try to have a student body that's very involved about issues. We encourage thought. We encourage discourse and conversation. So we try to maintain that love of challenging things and learning about the world around you. So we definitely, at our core, are very much activists, and we appreciate that. But we also want to make sure we listen to the other side of the yeah, equation. Definitely. So we do have new clubs that have sprouted up on campus from some organizations that have taken different views, but we really welcome that participation, and we want to make sure that we include all the conversations and all the different viewpoints, because that's how New York College gets stronger and better. I definitely.
specific about the science program that interested you in New York College? Um, shit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, chemistry. Okay, well you, uh, you, you studied chemistry in high school. Yeah. And you were very good at it? Yeah. Okay. Well, actually, <laughs> the teacher didn't like me, but I'm good at it. <laughs> I hate that teacher. I hate that teacher. It failed me, but I'm, I'm really smart. Uh, okay. Um, how about this? How about tell me three adjectives your friends would use to describe you and why? Um, fast. Okay. okay. Um, does that mean you do your work fast? That you're a fast learner? No, I mean, I'm just really fast on the rugby team. I like, I really like rugby. Okay. Yeah. Um, can we talk a little bit about academics? We have a very challenging program here, and what would you like to study if we um, let you come to New York College? Science. I told you, science. Okay. All right. <laughs> Okay. Um, so can you just tell me maybe one thing about uh, your favorite class in high school? I, it sounded like you had some challenges with chemistry. Um, hold on. <laughs> yeah, oh, okay. uh, my favorite, yeah. Um, I, I love science, I mean, I don't really like the classes in the morning because I'm not a morning person. So I'd rather have classes, um, you know, that are in the afternoon. And English was always in the morning, so I didn't do very well. Okay. Well, you know what, Molly? Thank you so very much for coming in. I think we've covered everything that we need to cover. Uh, really appreciate your taking the time to apply. Yeah. Okay. You too. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> 